Welcome to the party. Do you think love? Do you think of love as an ascent or descent? That's from um, CoStar. Hello, everyone. We're on our second video now. I'm gonna stop introducing it as like the new videos because at some point they're gonna not be the new videos. Um, but we're in the beginning stages of our new schedule and YouTube developments. <laughs> So I just recorded the air signs and now I'm going to do the fire signs is up next. Sag, Leo, and Aries. I know the fire signs really well. My moon is in Sagittarius and my Mars, Venus, and Jupiter is in Leo. <laughs> so I'm a Leo Stellium in my chart. So I understand fire so well. It's kind of creepy because I'm a, I'm a Cancer and it's like in my soul, in my heart, I'm a little bit of a fire, more so than water. I think Cancer is the only water placement that I have in my chart, and it's prominent because it's in it's the Sun. But there's a lot of times where I'm like trying to set shit on fire and blow shit up and impulsive and you know, so I understand. So let's get into it. Because it's fire sign, I want to start off with the new deck I got. Villains. Actually, let's do Prisma. Prisma Vision, Cosmo Vision is my favorite deck. Oh, I said that for every deck, right? <laughs> Not every day, but most of them. So we're channeling for the message before. I need to like find my flow. Actually, I'm thinking about my singing bowl too. Hold on. Stick with you. We can charge the cards before every reading with this. falling apart so we're going to do a six six card storyboard to past to present to future I like that a lot too so we're channeling for the fire signs oh baby are you falling in love i feel so oh. Mm, my chest, my heart is like gonna explode. Oh my god. What the fuck y'all got going on? Y'all falling in love? I hope so, because it's about time. Like I feel like I'm so uh that's how I feel. Six of fire. Five of fire. So those are the two past. Mm. The dreamer is in the present. I wanna. I need the book because I like to know exactly what's what it translates to in traditional tarot. Let's get all of them. So we need three more. Ooh, it started out so hot. Let's see what's going on. <laughs> I love channeling energy. It's crazy. Okay. Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Okay, since you want to be spicy about it. 
Eight of Pentacles in reverse, the Romantic in reverse, and Two of Birds. Oh. Got chills. Was y'all like, I don't want to say dealing with somebody and then somebody else, but. Is a use there's like a decision to be made type of thing like you have to decide you have to make a decision what you're gonna do what are you gonna do queen of swords so the dreamer translates to the queen of swords in um traditional tarot the romantic translate to the the knight of cups in traditional tarot tarot and it's reversed these cards are like abstract and chaotic in imagery so if you don't really see it it's this one then that's fine like see the imagery because it's a little bit hot in terms of like you know what i mean like the imagery is wild It started out so hot. The Queen of Swords, something happened in the middle. The Queen of Swords, the Eight of Pentacles. Like, it started out hot and then stopped. It stopped. Like, something stopped. And then it stopped. It stopped and it got cold. Got some chills. Why? Wow, what happened? Six of Fire. And then Five of Fire. Hmm. Like a, I saw like a letter, <laughs> paper. Mm. Um, 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 you stopped doing the work. Someone stopped doing the work. Stop doing the work and start looking other places. Like, oh, like, um, like a dog or what kind of animal is like, no, like, um, damn, what's the word I'm looking for? Like, you get distracted, like, you got distracted. That's what I'm trying to say. You got distracted. The dreamer. Okay. Eight of Pentacles. So you got distracted. You got you fell into your mind space, mental space. Stop doing the work. Eight of Pentacles in reverse. And you rested. So there's no shame in not doing the work. You rest. You stop. You reassess or you pull back or you you know what I mean? But then it left you in a space of not going with the flow and being stuck in indecision. Now, if, it, if this goes with um, like, whether you had like a passion for a person, a passion for your job or career, a passion for a circumstance, a passion for an event, a passion for whatever. You had the passion, you had the, the tenacity, something happened, it's the five of, five of, Fire. So it started out with the six of fire where it's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I felt when it first started. And then boom. And it, went, it was like six and then five. Like boom. Like knock the shit over. Blow it up. And now you have to reassess. And now you have to slow down. And now you have to stop. Now you have to stop doing what you're doing. And fall back and reassess. So if the Knight of Cups is in reverse, this is telling you to like stop your flow of water. Stop moving. It's so crazy because the fire sign, yeah, this is good. The fire sign, so this is good. So in thinking about me in particular in my life, I told myself no partying this weekend. I said, there's no party to go to. There's no event to go to. Like, don't find nothing. Don't go nowhere. Like, just go home, chill, relax, right? Because I usually am, like, on the weekend, I'm, like, one or two days out of the weekend, I'm going somewhere. Um, and it's been like that lately, especially since the weather started getting nice and stuff. So I told myself this morning, like, that, eh, or last night, don't go nowhere. Like, don't, there's nowhere to go. Um, and then, so now that's why I'm thinking, like, it's perfect, like, it's, you kind of felt like there was a, sh you felt shame, like I should be moving. A fire sign is always going to want to move and do something. You feel 
you feel accomplished when you do you like your move your movement like mm -hmm. fire it's like containing fire is like burn the house down like you don't want that you want it to move you want it to flow you want you know you want to be able to transmute your energy and alchemize and like make things and no not this time not this time go slow go slow to the point where you have stopped like you know how when mercury is in or any planet is in retrograde retrograde means that it's not moving forward it's not rotating forward it's actually stopped and it feels like it's moving backwards because it stopped but it doesn't there's no such thing as like like literally moving backwards it's just like gravitational energy like it's it's proceed to be going backwards so one thing i like to say often is you're not starting from zero you're starting from where point you at like there is no damn i have to start over or i have to stop i have to go back to the beginning like there is no such thing as beginning 11 11 there is no such thing as beginning what came first the chicken or the egg what came first, the Big Bang or God or the Big Bang? <laughs> and we all know what can come first, but what can come first? They both can come first. So there is no beginnings, only what you perceive to be the beginning. So there is no shame behind having to stop and having to go slow or having to reset. Reset. There is no shame. You just have to do it. It's beneficial to you. Because there is some, I don't want to say a big decision because there's only two of cups, I mean, two of birds here, two of swords. So you have on your plate, look at her plate. She's pulling the two slabs of ice. doing the work so there's 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 energy on your plate to be assessed but it's not life or death it's just you just having to like calibrate once more let me pull this one new deck what's this one the villains the disney villains <laughs> so let's see what is behind the two of swords what's behind this five Actually, we're gonna start from the top. What's behind the five of fire? What is the catalyst behind this destruction? I wanna do this one too. What's next? <laughs> what is the catalyst behind the five of fire for the fire sign? This is the, oh, baby, it starts to come up again. Now we're at the beginning. What happens? I think I stuck. Your, your, um, <laughs> your thoughts. <laughs> your thoughts got stuck again. Wow, so you start to think how you used to think before in the past. This is the past too, before in the past. Everything was going good and then you got to a point where you're like starting to think how you used to think. And how you used to think your old dreams, your old thoughts cannot sustain you today. No matter what part or what, no matter what point in your life you're in whether you perceive yourself to be more successful or not or whatever more in love or not whatever it is your you right now cannot be sustained and fueled by the thoughts of your past you have to keep generating new thoughts you have to keep generating new thoughts in your presentness that's going to keep you feeling high vibrationally high feeling good high so you could continue to ascend that question do you think of love as an ascent or a descent i'm taking these because this deck is hard to um it's new so we're gonna go in order right so this is the five of the five of embers 
strength. This is behind you, behind the um the five five of fire. You have to you fire signs, fire signs. You have a really great ability to take care of yourself. Like I can, oh, I can do it. Oh, I can do it. You have the strength. Oh, I can do it. It made you tired though. It made you very tired and exhausted. And sometimes you can get into this place in your, your consciousness or your subconscious where you're like, I have to take care of myself again. I have to tell, I have to empower myself some more. I have to like, I have to do everything. I have to do everything. You don't. Wheel of Fortune. We're just gonna go down the line. Oh. You have everything, you have everything. Wow, Ace of Wands. This is the um, Ace of Wands, look at that. King of Swords. This is Scar. Two of Swords. And the Chariot is my girl, Cruella. The Chariot is the Cancer card, that's me. Cruella de Vil, Cruella de Vil. <laughs> All right, let's do this. We got all these cards. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, we got the perfect amount too. You have like your like the dreamer was the Queen of Swords. So around the King of Swords, the Queen of Swords. So you had a new concept and new and new beginnings with the Ace of Wands and the King of Swords here in the same space with the Queen of Wands from the last deck. Even though the Eight of Pentacles is in reverse over there, you had like a new beginning. This 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 may be strong in love for sure. You started out with like a fire passion, like love. Um, you had a really like you thought you started to think differently, and so it generated a new beginning. Two of Swords twice is here. Okay, that's important. Two of Swords in the first Cosmovisions, and the Two of Swords here again. Okay. And then you got to a crossroads of having to decide. I wouldn't call it having, like, I wouldn't call it like a crossroads of having to decide, but you definitely had to. Yes. Thank you. Oh, thank you so much. It's my food. I wasn't. I thought I had to go downstairs and get it. It was quick too. So I didn't eat lunch, and that's, I need to not do that. Like I need to eat. Um, ever since I've been in the studio, like I haven't been like eating like as much as I used to because I've just been working. So two of swords twice. So it's got to a, a point in the like in the future, in the now, and you know, go, coming for coming forward, going forward, where you had like got dual sided with what you thought and what you believed to be true, and what's happening. Whatever is the most beneficial, and I mean like in the most generic way, whatever is the most. Ascendatory, like ascended thought process for you, like ascended feelings, like whatever raises your bar, raises your energy, is what you need to decide, choose. You know what I mean? Because the cherry is here at the end, so you're you're going forward, like you're like I'm moving forward, but it has to be based on the, the, the thought process of. This is making me better. This is making me smarter. This is making me feel more love. This is making me feel calmer. It's making me, there's a post on Instagram that's like, but does he calm your nervous system though? 
does he calm like how you feel like when you see him when you with him does he like make you feel at peace and like yo i felt that recently like i went on a date with a guy and even like texting or like planning the date it was just like it just felt like it was too much like it was just like why do i feel like i have to like pull your teeth like you don't gotta fucking talk to me <laughs> you don't have to talk to me you don't have to go nowhere with me there's nothing with me you don't gotta you don't gotta you don't gotta do shit with me and yet here you are on my phone and so it leaves you in this space of confusion let me show you both the two of the two of swords cards because you're like but you're here here you are but you're playing and so now i'm not calm so i'm gonna decide to just leave even if it hurts and this is the thing i think that we get really like hell-bent and hung up on when the, the right decision hurts because you, you think that the right decision is supposed to feel good you're supposed to be like ah yes i've come to terms like i it makes sense you, you want to believe that it's supposed to feel that good i mean but you realize that the right decision is it, it hurts you sometimes it's like oh i have to leave my favorite person or i have to start again with this new beginning with someone else or something else even though it's not necessarily starting over and that's the thing with this two of swords is like i'm like reframing your thought process behind it so if you feel like you have to start over with someone new it's not starting over because now you have a new understanding of what you want of what you'll tolerate of what you'll accept of what you don't want to accept you know what i mean so it's not the same and it's not starting over it's new beginning it's new it's new it's new it's forward right it's forward the chariot corella deville like can we talk about Cru Cruella Deville energy? Like she gonna get what she want, and she gonna do what she needs to do to get what she want. Fire sign, Leo, Aries, such as Harry is like I'm gonna do what I wanna do. I got my own rules. I dress the way I dress. I like. Do you like in this day and age, right? You know women who have half black and half white hair. Like them bitches is crazy. <laughs> in the most like loving, I am obsessed with it type of way. Like. I used to dye my hair, not half colors, but it definitely was a color. But like, I know I've seen women who have half black and half white hair, half, half hair. Like you're a wild woman, you're gonna do what you wanna do. Yeah, moving forward based on how you feel in your chest. Not because, oh my, the little girl in me or the broken heart in me or the friends or the family is telling me, no. No other, no, nothing is determining your decisions. Only you, only how you feel, only which, what's gonna make you believe that love is an ascent, an ascending, an ascending thing, energy. Do you think love, do you think of love as an ascent or a descent? What do you think? Two of swords, pick a side. Pick the side that feels uh, most peaceful to you. Most peaceful to you. A lot of swords here, a lot of wands here. A lot of swords, a lot of wands. I like this. It's time in the present moment to stop pushing forward and to actually focus on what you think, your mindset. Is what's more more important right now. Not oh, let me put some more effort in. Let me let me put my best foot forward. Like fuck the feet, moving the feet. Fuck the effort. Don't do nothing. Sit down, change your mindset, and now you're able to make a you you're able to follow go down the pathway that benefits you the most. Don't worry about what energy and effort you're putting into something. Like let let others do for you sometimes like let other people like be thirst for you and do extra work for you and accept that you have given you've given as much as you can possibly give and just chill for a second and and receive in your feminine and relax <laughs> and then once you're able once you know what you want to do once you know exactly what energy play you want to move on and you feel calm and you feel at peace in your mind then your action will follow and you can be the wild 
beastly woman or man, it doesn't matter. And you could move forward and move on. I like that. I like how it just is like. Because you love the passion. You love the passion as a fire sign. You need it. You need it. And when it starts to dissolve or it starts to like alchemize into this weird, funky energy, it throws you off. And you're like, what's happening here? Like, what happened to the fire? What happened to the passion? From from internally, externally, like from my partner, from this job, from whatever. Like, what happened to the drive and the ambition that I felt before? And, you know, you say, like I say, like, oh, internally, externally. Like, yeah, the external is a reflection of internal. So if you start to see, like, externally, the, the fire has died down and everything has shifted, you... Take a look and you do an internal inventory of your soul and yourself. Like, okay, this is what has happened. This is what happened. Okay. Because of what's happening internally. Your mindset. Your mindset has thrown you off where the fire and the passion has died down. And now it's time for you to get work on that mind, that mental strength. And catapult. When it all starts... For real. And that was good. I like that. <laughs> Beautiful. Yeah, that's it. I love it. Okay. Nice air signs. Fire signs. My bad. I just said air signs before. Fire signs. I hope that, that you felt that. <laughs> I hope that it resonated in some way. If it did, comment, like, let me know. Share with all your fire sign friends. Um, yeah, make it work. Make it, make it, no, make it work and get jiggy with it. <laughs> all right, I'm out of here. I got my food. I'm going to take Peace.